Hello traders and welcome to another turbulent day in the markets. My name's Des here at Rock Trade. It's Thursday, July 14th, 2011 and the markets are down. We have the Dow down 0.44%, the S&P down 0.67%, NASDAQ down over 1%, 1.22% in the red. Russell's down a huge amount, 1.63% down. Banks were down about a one and a half percent. A pop here in the VIX, up 4.5%. Gold up just a little, so silver. US dollar break even. Crude oil down 2.09%. And here we are. Today we made a lower high and a lower low. We're continuing with the down leg. We did find support at the rising 20 day moving average and also this 1305 support level that we are watching so closely. But things look a little weak. We're here looking at the MACD and we are starting to threaten a crossover down here of the zero line. If so, we should drop pretty good down here to the bottom. And, uh, but Google came out with some really uh, decent earnings. They beat projections going out into the future, which sent the stock straight up. Believe it or not, I'm going to go there right now. I'll do a still one minute chart. You see these bad ticks taking place. Um, I entered this trade. I entered it twice. I entered it rising, got out of it, reloaded here. And you can see that. But I, um, I, I'm, I'm still writing this. I was day trading. Get this, day trading, Google after hours. Look at all this volume, huge amount of volume. We're getting these bad ticks. I actually put a limit order to pick up another hundred shares at 5:40 down here, if I could be so lucky to get it. But um, even with these ticks dropping, I'm not picking up anything cheap. But that's where I'm at right now, and uh, let's see what happens tomorrow. I mean, we're trading at 588. If you go to a daily, 588 would put us way up there. That's going to be a big gap we're going to get tomorrow. So nice job, Google. Let's see what that does to the markets because the markets will need it. We're in earnings season right now, and we need a lot of good earnings coming out to boister this market. However, if I were to draw a quick fib here, it looks like, uh, yeah, we just crossed over the 50. We need to stay above 1300. 1300 is a big area that I'm watching. So be watching 1300. If we can find support at 1300, I will go long if it bounces. So there you have it. This is a good time to be hedged in the markets. If you don't know how to hedge, go to teachmetohedge.com, teachmetohedge.com. And that will obviously be of service to you to help you safeguard your money in this turbulent market. Take care and safe trading. And tomorrow we have the CPI, so inflation numbers coming out pre-market. And that can also act as a catalyst. So be watching that.